Hey! Okay, so I'm here to do week 34 update. Excuse my look. It is very hot today for me. Um, it is about 80 degrees. Kind of stuffy and muggy. Um, so I had a doctor's appointment last Monday, so a week ago. I'm pretty good. Nothing's really changed. Um, I'm starting now to get my birth plan together. And um, I'm using this website called Baby Bump, I think it is. And they have like a, a sheet that you can print that is very helpful. Um, because, to be honest, I had no idea where to start, so, um, I think it's pretty much going to go like I did with, um, my other two kids, just kind of play it by ear and, um, make sure I'm making the choices and, um, whatnot, so, I'm pretty confident in this labor and delivery, um, I shampooed my carpets and like really scrub my kitchen floor and I somewhat put myself in labor <laughs> and um, it wasn't very serious I went to the hospital and um, they slowed down with extra water and whatnot and they just said come on take it easy you've got I've now got six weeks left or less and so I just need to chill out so um, I, I understand I just I don't know I had the urge to like really clean my house and I did and I feel good about it and so um, it's not like I was heavy lifting and my husband did help me he shampooed most of the carpets I think it was just like me being on the floor like scrubbing the stains and like on my kitchen floor scrubbing along the walls and whatnot so um, I got my first gift today everything that we have uh, that we have for the baby we have purchased ourselves um, I still have my baby shower coming up uh, May 19th and um, so that's always fun anticipating a waiting um, <sighs> But my friend Laurel, she can't make it to my shower, so she purchased these bibs for us, which I love. I love these bibs, um, especially just in the beginning. They're just a terry cloth. Um, I really like these kind of bibs, but um, with the liner in the back, so that way it doesn't soak through onto the clothes. And for some reason, in her package, because I got it in the mail, see, I got a razor. Um, I don't know if I was supposed to get a razor. It's not on the list. It just says, like, you get this, right? And it just says what you purchase, or what they purchased. And it just says the 10 pack of boy bibs. It does not say anything about razor. <laughs> Whatever. Um, I did have something smaller to update on. So my doctor and I were talking and when I went in to see her, I assumed I was at 32 weeks. I think anyways and she's like no oh my gosh so when I went to this ultrasound place um, for high-risk pregnancies they started like I was like five weeks pregnant so all they saw was a gestational sac or two gestational sacs and they measured at five weeks and so then um, they went off of that instead of my um, last menstrual cycle and so they gave me the due date of June 12th 
Well, my doctor's going in the middle between my menstrual cycle and the gestational sac, and so my new due date is June 3rd. So I am 34 weeks and one day pregnant today, which is Monday. Which is fine. I mean, if he comes, you know, in three weeks, which would be 37 weeks, he'll be perfectly healthy. I feel like he's a really big baby, so um, I don't have any fear of him being harmed or born too early or born too late. So um, that's the only difference. I did start going to physical therapy, and that really helped. Um, I stopped going because I, didn't, I just don't need to go anymore. Um, let's see here. I have an appointment next Wednesday, which is the second, and I have to get my group B strep test, is that what it's called, done, which is super exciting, and I'm going to try to have my birth plan ready then for her. So um, other than that, I think everything is going good. Uh, I'm tired a lot, <laughs> and um, sleeping is a little bit more difficult. I'm peeing a lot more um, throughout the night. I don't have any food cravings. So far I've gained 17 pounds, and that's about it. Um, I'll show you my belly. It's humongous. And then that should be it. Let's see. That's 34 weeks. That's huge to me. Super low. And he's still sticking out right there. You can see that bump. I don't know, it's glaring so bad. That would be my daughter watching Lazy Town. Um, anyways, thanks for watching. Um, subscribe, comment. I love reading comments and just getting a bunch of positive feedback. Um, I still have not announced his name on here. Um, I don't know when I'm going to. Maybe when he's born. Because we still haven't chosen a middle name. We've chosen a first name. Um, so, I don't know. <laughs> anyways. Excuse me. Thank you for watching, and um, I will see you guys for week 35. Bye!